Santiago Cliff, Cliff, Cliff! Yep, Cliff. that's Welcome me! Welcome to the St. Augustine's Asylum for the Mentally Ill. Ooh. My producer Tom said good things about you. <laughs> In your backpack is a flashlight, a voice recorder, an EMF, and a couple of little fun occult things. We'll let you know when to take those out. Uh-huh. Ready to pay off some of those college debts and beer debts? Well, of course you are. Sure. And when you're ready, enter in through those front doors. All right, well, this is locked. So I'm going to assume that it's the other door. Hey, what's going on, Jesus? Also, why, why do we have a painting of a booty? I mean, isn't this an asylum? I can interact with it. Well, it is a hospital. I mean, it would be weird if there wasn't any type of anatomy stuff. True, but why the booty, though? Extra thick! I mean, I'm not complaining. A booty is a booty, and you know what they say? A booty is bootiful. Cringe. A booty is a booty, and a booty is bootiful. A booty is a booty. I'm, I'm, I'll stop. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, this is it. Nice. The door was unlocked. Ah, it can get a little sticky sometimes. So really here's creepy. the story behind the St. Augustine's Asylum for the Mentally Ill. It was founded in the 1880s, closed in the 1960s, and a lot of nasty stuff happened here. I mean, this place like is only supposed to house around 500 patients, but at its peak, it was around 3,300 patients in here. I mean, the place was, you know, less of a hospital and more of a place where you dropped your problems off and hope they disappeared. Are y'all seeing what I'm seeing? What is that? <laughs> this hurts my eye. Oh my god. What? This was an asylum? Why do we have these paintings here? This doesn't make any sense, dude. Wow. Also, he keeps saying hospital. I, this is open now. Okay. This is where the hundred hallways patients would convene, and we heard that the patients pre-1920 actually received decent care. Then the war hit, the depression hit, and then the budgets all fell apart. The room you stand in once healed 20 patients in need of attention. And by oh, wow. the end, 150 patients have passed through this room, naked, starving, attacking each other at random, flaying themselves with metal wires from their beds. Yeah. Be careful where you step. Alright, this is a good place to start. I want you to take out your voice recorder, and I'll hopefully be able to awaken this place. Uh, awaken okay. what? Spirits of St. Augustine. Oh my god! Please reveal your presence to us. Show us that you are in this room. Please don't. Feel free to interact with anything. Not me? Or speak to us. Use your words, use your voice, and let us know that you're here. Let him know. <laughs> I don't have anything to do with it. Okay, play that back. Oh my god. Know that you're here. Oh, we're gonna die. Ghosts? I don't see anything. Uh, nothing. Alright, let's try that again. No. No, 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 no. Can I get out of here? <laughs> I don't want to do this again. Bruh! I'm gonna get jump scared so bad. I just, I, I feel it. Alright, alright, let's try this. Ghosts of St. Augustine, please let us know that you are still in this hospital. Uh uh. I give you permission I to don't. reveal yourself. I give you permission to come to life. We're just gonna die. Give us a sign that you're here. Tell us where you are. Speak to us now into this microphone. Okay, nothing right, yet. That. Now into this microphone. Oh boy. Oh boy. Alright, let's try one more spot. Oh my god, okay. Oh, <laughs> why do I feel like this is gonna be the spot? Oh, uh, guys! I don't wanna do this. This is dumb. <sighs> Ghosts of St. Augustine, you're all a bunch of ghoulish pricks. What? Show up! What? what? Bro, up. what is wrong with you? <gasps> Shit! I saw it. Whoa, 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 did I hear that? Did I hear it? I saw them! Pricks, show up or piss off! What is wrong with a man? I, I'm getting out of here. I got the footage! Someone's laughing. Oh, give oh, me up! Oh, 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 oh. <sighs> so right, funny, right, isn't it? Looks like we got an investigation. Alright, I want you to go down the morgue hallway. And we're going to continue our investigation in the other gathering area. Wait, 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 what? First it was a hospital, then it became an asylum, and now it's a fucking morgue? <sighs> I gotta stop cussing, I'm sorry. You too! I love you! Don't demonetize me! Okay, morgue hallway. This is not it. Patient rooms 120 to 139. Oh, man. Why am I still here? I got the footage! 
Oh, this is bad. This okay, is the really four bad. areas you need to visit to fulfill your contract. The East Social Area is the first on the list. This is the area where the inmates who are deemed a danger to society would be. You'll go to this room and perform a summoning ceremony. Uh, so walk into the center and we will begin. See, this is when you should quit. Like, this is not worth it, bro. How much are they paying Entrance me? Entrance to patient cells 200 through 219. Eh, we're talking extreme bipolarism, schizophrenia, dementia. Not necessarily dangerous, but it can be a challenge for society. I mean... The door's locked. This sucks. Yeah, people with schizophrenia can be very violent, bro. Trust me, I live in Cali and I've seen some. The cells 220 to 240. This is where they kept the lunatics, the murderers, the sociopaths. The worst of the worst, including Clive the Peeper Johnson. You'd think Ooh. he would be a pervert with a nickname the Peeper, but the truth is far worse. He was extremely manipulative and very intelligent. He was a murderer and a maimer. Most of his victims could never identify him because he managed to convince them to gouge their own eyes out with metal wires and even their own what? fingernails. He came here due to legal loopholes, and when the facility went off the rails and the doctor stopped caring, he jumped into action. The patients who didn't listen were tortured, and the ones who did wandered around the facility, blind, screaming, and in constant fear. So maybe this is why we have, like, to. all these paintings. Let's just start the ceremony. Oh my god, this is so disturbing, dude. Wow. So patients just, like, took out their eyes? Spirits inside Whoa, inside. hold we up, hold up, hold up. We release you from your restraints. Come forward and live again. Please don't. This person is no longer shielded from the ah! realm of the oh, dead. Bro! You may be bro, seen she's dancing! You may interact and manipulate him in any way as you see fit. Okay, that wasn't too scary. <laughs> they kind of looked funny, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Jump scare? Oh, maybe not. Someone's behind me. Someone's behind me! I'm cool. I'm cool. I'm cool. Just stare at the eye. I can't. Go check it out. But what do you mean, go check it out? This is open. Oh, fuck. See, he's not here. That's the issue. Why am I doing this alone? Like, where's my crew? This is a TV show. <laughs> oh my god, this is not worth it. Oh, cool. Hello? Demon? What was his name, Peeper? I mean, there's two of them. Or like, ten of them. I'm cool. I'm cool. I'm cool. It was just a stupid head. Got my footage. Now get out. I'm sorry, neighbors. I'm sorry. I'm not going in there. Why would I go in there? This is so stupid. <gasps> that got me a little bit. Not too much, though. God, I'm just gonna sing and ignore these jump scares. I'm not afraid we have a room full of boxes. Hey, we have a room full of boxes. What was that song I was singing? The the booty one? A booty is a booty and a She's gonna sit on it. Right? That sounded so wrong, I'm sorry. <laughs> I meant the wheelchair. <laughs> No. <laughs> my heart. Hold up, let me just breathe. Please, this game is just something else. This is locked. Oh my god. I'm laughing and getting scared. It's just a coping mechanism. Hey there. I mean, she doesn't look too scary. She kind of looks hot, no? Hey baby. How's it going? <laughs> Are you gonna scare me? Three, two, one? Ooh. Okay! <laughs> you kinda look like the scream! That wasn't too bad. Get the hell out of there. Just just go to the front okay. door and get out. I'm getting out. Oh! Ah! 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 Ignore everything. Ah! Oh, they're gonna jump scare me here. Alright, get out of this hallway and then take, a, take your second right. Maybe not. Okay, second right, which is here? I'm moving. 
My character is slow uh, as fuck. Oh, damn it, damn it. Oh, okay, there's a, there's a staircase. Take the staircase up staircase. to the second floor, and you should be next to a fire escape. You should be able to get out that way. So, Where so is go it, up the though? Staircase. Uh, staircase to floor two. We got it. Oh, hell no. Hello? Is anyone in here? Oh, she's gonna be behind the door. I can feel it! It's locked! Oh no. Don't look behind you. Or look very slowly. I just spat. I'm sorry. <laughs> Is it spit or spat? I keep asking the same goddamn question every episode. Someone oh, tell me. Okay, we need to. Let's go get something to pry this door open. Go back downstairs. I, I bet you there was something downstairs we could probably use. Hold on, hold on. That staircase wasn't there before. Though it wasn't? This place doesn't even have a basement. What the. What, what is going on? Alright, alright, just. I don't what? think you got any other choice. I think you gotta make your way downstairs. Oh, this is such a bad idea. Surgery. I keep clicking off the game. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Why do we have candles? Why are they lit up? Is this an asylum? Or a hospital? It doesn't... Uh, this is... The, the, the morgue? Hey, what up, buddy? What's going on with you? It's locked. I'm sorry. I can't help you. <laughs> Hello? Peeper, which way should I go? Uh, left or right? I'm gonna go right, because right is right. Right? Okay, no. Yeah, we're supposed to go left. <sighs> All right, let me breathe, let me relax. Oh my god, this is getting very stressful. Not gonna lie. Nothing yet. Oh, I might need a code? No. Oh, shit! I'm sorry, I'm sorry, neighbors, I'm sorry. Oh my god, my voice hurts. Oh, fuck. All right, we're moving. What's next? Oh, uh, long hallway. Never fun. You know what this means, don't you? Jump scare in five, four, three, two, one. You don't scare me. Locked. Okay. It's gonna be okay. I gotta stop saying okay. I suck at commentary. Whoa. Whoa. Okay, they're messing with me. What, what do I do? No eyes, don't see, I'm in a cell. <laughs> Guys, if I move forward, someone's gonna jump scare me. I can feel it. Watch. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There's someone behind me. There's blood? Dripping? Ah! Oh my god! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. My flashlight! Bitch! She took my flashlight! I I don't want to see anything related to eyes. Ah, my eyes! I love them! Someone was there. Mm. 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 Oh, my eyeballs! Oh, on a desk! Alright, confession time. Uh, it's about the eyes. I kind of had this from you. There's an urban legend, and, and I, I repeat, it's an urban legend about the peeper Clive Johnson. You see, the, there was a patient who suffered from dementia and swore that Clive was more than just a mere man. And uh, he would kind of haunt this patient all throughout the day. You know, rampant hallucinations that progressively got worse, but at night he never saw the peeper. Then he discovered that if he closed his eyes, he could escape Clive. But whenever oh. he opened them... Clive would be there, waiting for him, and so that's why he took him out. Closer. Eventually, the patient used a fork, and he blinded himself. That's and so While he was up. soaked in his blood from his sockets, he screamed to the entire hospital that he was free, he was safe. And a week later, two more patients charged Clive with stalking them, even though he was confined to solitary. I mean, it's crazy. Holy they, they shit! They took their eyesight too. 
pattern didn't stop. I thought it was BS, but based on what we've <laughs> he seen, said tonight, BS. I don't pretty much believe anything. <laughs> so, try to get the hell out of there, and if it gets too intense, try to shut your eyes. Try to. How do I do that? E? S? Bruh. You gotta give me instructions, man. Will my character do this automatically? He better. So wait, that means I'm gonna meet five? Damn flashlight broke. I can't use that anymore. Oh yay. Yay! A dead person. Don't move. Don't move! Who said that? Someone said come here. Where? Oh my god. My heart. Hmm. I'm coming closer. Okay. Uh, I don't see you. No! It's okay. It's okay. Is that Clyde? He doesn't look scary. Oh, I thought it was going to be worse. <laughs> okay. Uh, why am I getting intense music? Is this the end? This really feels like the end. I'm going to keep moving. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Mm. Ignore everything. If you ignore stuff, then, then that means it's not there. Hey, what's going on, the beautiful ladies? We're doing it, guys. We're doing it. It's not scary. I told you. I've seen worse. I'm kidding. It is scary, but it's not like super terrifying. I'm gonna get jump scared right now. Oh fuck! All right, just finish me. Just ah! Uh, is that a book? What is that? Oh crap! I think I know what's going on. Either he gets you, or you're you're gonna have to cut him out. Oh no 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 no! I'm not cutting out my eyes, man. What, what? guys? Ah! Uh, I, I, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't do it. My what eyes, I love my eyes, man. Just, just kill me. Get it over. F in the chat for my character. You fought Holy well. crap. I can't believe it. That was the most disturbing, terrifying, and greatest paranormal footage that has ever been taken in the history of television. Oh my god, Tom. For real? We are going to win an Emmy. We might be on talk shows, paranormal entities, movies, spin-offs, freaking coffee mugs. I died and this shows. fucker Holy is happy? Crap. Oh my god. Oh yeah. Him? Him? <laughs> I'm not going in there. Are you going to go in there? I'm not going in there. Hell no, 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 no. I mean, we don't even know where he is in that hospital. The camera's black. He's not responding. I don't see anything. Do you? No. no. I really hope he gets you. And, uh, Someday. Anyways, another crazy thing about this. He needs to collect his money, too. Oh, uh, yeah. You don't get to pay me. Yay for you. Soon. So, so we, we basically got all this footage for free, dude. Let's just start the band up. Let's get the hell on out of here. We've been I should have never for, listened to you. I don't know, a couple hours, just a little bit too long. I'm a little sore. I need to stretch out. And my very wealthy friend, you, are starting to stink. All right, I'm going to do it. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. Is he going to get him? Did you hear that? Did you, did you hear that? Shh. Listen, listen. I'm listening. Oh, fuck. That, that was outside the truck. That yes! was outside the truck, right? Something. Yes! I'm sorry, this is like terrible, but fuck you, man! I see you now. Get him. I want to assume that he got him, so... Good job, bro! Thank you for playing. Please leave a review uh, on the page to let me know your thoughts about the game. My name is Al Heck, and I made this game in 10 days. In 10 days? Bruh! That was fucking phenomenal! That was really good, dude. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Um, guys, let me know what you thought down below in the comments. If you enjoyed it, please hit that like button, subscribe, and come to Valley Warrior, and stay awesome! I'll see you in the next episode!